Hello and welcome back to Captain Flint Gaming. I am Flint's first mate. Uh, we're gonna jump back into some Quantum Break. Uh, just looking at the timeline there, just kind of everything we've been doing, where we've come. But you can't really tell where we're going yet. Thanks for tuning in. Previously on Quantum Break. Watch. I came back home to see my best friend, Paul Serene. Jack Joyce, in the flesh. He wanted to show me what he'd been working on. Paul said it was world changing. Two minutes to the past. Jack. Well, you have to help me with this. We have to shut this thing down now. Zero state. <sighs> what have we done? Ah! Jack! There's no other way out. We're going through the machine. Paul, wait. No. Jack! This way! Jack! Are you Jack Joyce? Where's my brother? You might still be able to catch them. Paul? I'm sorry, Jack. I never wanted this. We can't risk any unwanted attention. Initialize a PR campaign. We need the city on our side. Nice recap there, yeah. What led you to the swimming hall? Oh, Will said there was something important in this briefcase. All I found was a key with Bradbury swimming hall on the chain. Only lead we had. I guess this is it. This building's been shut down for years. Perfect place to hide something you don't want found. I think it's time you tell me what you know. I know your brother built the one thing that can stop the fracture. I know we're meant to find it, and I know Modern doesn't want us to. And yet you're wearing their uniform. I like the way their pants fit. Yeah, I bet you like the paycheck, too. Trying to create a cover to gather information. You've known about this for a few hours. I've been preparing for it for most of my life. You weren't aware that William owned the place? There's a lot I didn't know about Will. We need to find your brother's countermeasure. And fast. Things will get worse as the fracture progresses. And Monarch will be turning Riverport over looking for you. Will's key. Maybe it unlocks this. The key doesn't fit. Okay. I'm gonna find another way in. Make it quick. I'll keep a lookout for unwanted company. Snicker, snicker. Can you find a way in, Jack? We shouldn't stay out here. There's no way in over here. I think we gotta go around the other side. This place looks awesome now, the flowers and stuff. Nissan again. Here we go. Maybe. Here we go. Ah, oh, here we go. My bad. How was that little? How was that device that we were trying to find? Spray paint on the wall. That's kind of weird. Hey, I think I found a way in. All right. Upgrades. I got two points. That could be nice. Uh, I feel like the dodge might be the best one. The time after the hour. Oh, I cost four. We might save them then, because I don't think that is going to be the most useful thing right now. Or that. Because they're all, like, pretty good by themselves, still. So. And I jump. 
Super weird when that shutter's Will have used the our building studies. to hide away his personal items. What the hell were you doing here, brother? Time travel experiments with rats? Twelve thousand dollar moving bill. You must have hauled a lot more to this place than just some old boxes. Seventeen trucks in seventeen days. You owned this place since 1999? Why didn't you tell me, Will? Must have been a little bit of a youngster back then. Not too old. No wonder you were always coming up with crazy shit. Yeah, that, that was kind of a treasure trove of Hello, story. Report. Teresa said back here. Radio's dead anyway. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. Hold on to your butts, ladies. Any luck in there? Working on it. All right, let's take a look around. Down here. Let's do it, boo. Nice work. Is she allowed in here, guys? We're in the Jan's area. This Come note. On. It's directed at me. Beth. July 4th, 2010. Well. Beth Wilder, I'm addressing this video to you. You told me to stay away from my workshop, but I couldn't just leave it there. I went back to get it. The entire place is a disaster zone. The countermeasure, gone. Taken. Shit. What the... Safe. Empty. I just need to know you have it. Because if it falls into the wrong hands, its power is immeasurable. Our future, our entire lives depend on it. This can't all be for nothing. You know where to find me. Please, hurry. 2010. Holy shit. What was that? He recorded that for me in 2010? What the fuck? He said the countermeasure's gone? It's not good. We need to figure this out. Let's keep looking. That's kind of weird, you know? He did that six years ago. You got something for us. Did you find something? Paint. And it's still wet. I think someone was here recently, Jack. You may want to stay here until we make sure it's safe. Yeah, I think you're right. Help me push this out of the way. Evo. Jack, your brother addressed that video to me. But I've never met him before in my life. Well, it sounded like he thought you had his countermeasure. I wish. But he said it was stolen on July 4th, 2010. Somebody took it. Boom, baby. But I'm hoping this place will help us figure out who. I feel like it would smell real bad in here after a while. 
I'll give you the honor of pressing the button. Big red button. Got a lot. Is that? Yeah, I think so. The second Whoa. time machine. This changes everything. If we can get this thing working, then we don't need that countermeasure. We can change everything. What if we stop the fracture from ever happening in the first place? We can go back to yesterday, undo everything in the past before it happens. Nobody dies. Paul doesn't go through the machine. Monarch never exists. I mean, the fracture never occurs. Jack, wait. Let's think this through. That's not how it... I can go into the machine like Paul did at the university. I helped them set it up. Then we activate the core, put the corridor in place, and set the date. I can do it, Beth. I'm not so sure we can do this without the countermeasure. But you're right. We need the machine. It says the time machine core needs to be reset. Great. What the hell does it look like? A round thing in the middle. I think. These are some old computers, ladies and gentlemen. Hey! It looks like I can reset the core from here. In there? No clue. But I, I did help Paul set up the machine at the university. Which then caused the fracture. Look, Will knew the calculations were wrong. I'm hoping that means he knew what he was doing here. This is what Will was leading us to. We have to test it. The core. That's what we set up first. could actually be the key to finding the countermeasure. We'll see. It's still resetting. The core is reset. We Here need to go. activate it from the control booth. I can't insert the, the data. The controls are up here, according to the monitor. Here goes nothing. We don't have anybody on... Analytics like we did last time. That was Paul last time. Oh well. Got a what risk it for a biscuit. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It worked. <laughs> it actually worked. Okay. We activate the corridor next. Okay, there is no way that thing should be exposed like that. This was the final step. I need to set up the machine first. Ah. The core plenty of exercise. It's key activated. Will's key. Schematics are all in Will's writing. He did all of this. Built everything. It's Monarch brilliant. was made aware of its existence shortly after it was completed. In 1999. 1999. They believe it was destroyed shortly after. I imagine Will wanted to keep it that way. Send this email to Beth somehow. This console says date input. I'm guessing this is it over here. Okay, it's perfect. Crap. 
that. Here we go. No, 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 no. What? God damn it. I don't know. We were so close. I'm gonna try it again. Yeah, like hell you are. You saw what happened. Something's wrong with the machine. Well, we don't know that. You're not trained for this. Anything you do is gonna make it worse. We you can't. know I'm right. Stop trying. You lost people. You're angry. I get it. But this is bigger than us. We can't fix the machine. But I might know somebody who can. Sophia Amaral. The monarch scientist. I saw her video in your Ground Zero. Serene's head of Cronin Research. She'll be at the Monarch Gala tonight, but security's airtight. She'll be nearly impossible to get to. Unless I have an invite. Paul told me he expected me to meet him at that party. Something tells me that was not a friendly invitation. Jack, no. Oh, bummer. Yeah, I don't think this is the best idea. Ooh, that's a nice car. Who's ever had? Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. The end of Act 2. In case you can't read. I'm just saying it for you. Ooh, that was crazy, though. Trying to go back in time. I can't believe he had his own time machine, but I don't know if you guys saw that. You can go back and read that email. He was, uh, well listening to Beth. But it's like, Monarch built a new one. But it's all screwy. Alright, thanks for tuning in, guys. Uh, make sure to keep tuning in. I'm gonna be uploading as often as I can. Uh, but, you know, I'm also working with my, my friend, the Captain Flint man himself. So, check back every day. And uh, you should have at least one new piece of content when, uh, from some of us. So, uh, thanks for tuning in again, and I will see you.